Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is Peter's TV. This is the channel that gives latest vibes to the world. Spreading, trading, news and gist about celebrating. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to my channel. Turn on the notification bell to get notified when we upload new videos. Stay tuned and enjoy. Hi guys and welcome back to this wonderful channel. My name is KING, the king himself. Uh, it's a very wonderful thing to be here. Wow, what is this that I'm hearing? Like, oh my God, what is really happening to the entertainment industry? Like, it's quite very worse and very bad. Like, entertainment, especially the music aspect of the entertainment industry. Ah, uh -uh, wow. No, 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 no. I am broken hearted. I am, I am disappointed. I am saddened. This is so painful. Wow, fear grips Nigerian music industry as Ola Dips dies two months after Mubad. Yes, Ola Dips. Ola Dips is a Yoruba pro uh, rapper. Yes, rapper Ola Dips passed on. Oh, more waiting to happen. Okay, we have Divago. Divago is a comedian, a social media influencer who wrote, All of you said he chased clouds. I hope you're all happy because I knew Hola will never chase clouds. He has never chased clouds to promote his song. So you people thought we start now. Oh, my guy, RIP. What could have happened? What happened? I I'm very sure he was saying all this in his songs and all. <sighs> God, I am, I am not happy. On Wednesday morning today, news of the latest, tra latest tragedy in the Nigerian music industry began to spread, confirming the death of rapper Oladipupa Oladimeji, a.k.a. Oladibs. I have met Oladibs one-on-one -on -one before, like, we've met very well. That was when I was still in the University of Ifeo, now known as Obafemi Aulo University. We met one-on-one, -on -one, and I can tell you that this guy uh, was an embodiment of talent. Now let's continue. A statement released by his management confirmed that a 28 year old passed away on Tuesday night around 10 pm. So it's just a year older than Mubad. It's red. We are saddened to inform the general public that Ola de Pupo Ola de Bodhi Ola de Meji Eke Ola Dibs has passed away yesterday, November 14th, Tuesday evening at exactly 10 14 pm. We are still in shock as we speak. For over two years, he has kept his battles within himself. His body is now with his family and funeral services will be announced as soon as it is concluded. Oh my God. You know, if if it is in the olden days, I mean, the, the, the way Twitter, you will tell you, uh, they, they, they will always say that a sacrifice or series of sacrifices must be made so that equal door will stop, like the youth dying. This is just too, too, too tragic. What? His body is now with his family and funeral services will be announced as soon as it is concluded. The family asks that we respect their privacy in this trying time. May God give us all the fortitude to bear this great loss. Amen. Interestingly, Allah Deep sent out scary messages on Instagram stories before his death. And I'm going to actually talk about that. In the post, he mentioned one of his friends at only one lifetime and asked where he was. The rapper complained about I had tried to reach the friend on the phone several times and how they knew he didn't like to be left alone in the house, especially with his condition. Wow. So it means something is... Oh, God. Oh, so for two years. Yeah, this was what he wrote. Please, where are you? At only one lifetime. I don't call your number. I talk, see, making I know they leave only me for this house. I don't talk this thing like a million times. Not even this period like this. Please, they come out. Please, tell your long. Um, oh my god, this is um, I'm short of words. I know I know I know lie you. Alright, let's 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 continue. What followed next was a video of Ola Deep slumped inside car and his friends in panic. It led to talk about PR from cynical fans who have since realized the gravity of the situation. All of this brings back the memories, yeah, the memories of promise or Ladimiji Aloba A.K. Mubad Imole, who died on the 12th of September. Yeah, that's like two months ago now. That was when our great Mubad died. Mubad cried out for help for many months after he left Malia music. Yes, after he left Malia music, he cried for a lot of months. And then leveling allegations of intimidation, assault, and bullying at his former bosses. Nothing really happened until he passed on. And then the mass hysteria demanding justice began. But at what point is one dead too much in the Nigerian music space? What is more scary is that Ola still has Mobad's picture as his display picture on Instagram. Almost something they happen. No? Like, I'm, I'm, like, this is... Oh God, seriously, this is crazy, you. 
This is crazy. And then we also have shame on those who said he was chasing clouds. Emotional reactions as rapper Oladips passes on. The entertainment world is reeling. Yes, reeling, reeling, reeling. From the sudden and tragic loss, oh God, of rapper Oladips. Yes. <laughs> Uh, of rapper Ola Dibs. Uh just 30 minutes ago, like I said, uh, his management, they said uh, he died due to uh, a secretive long-term battle, uh, the details of which, uh, yeah, we're still going to know much about that, I'm so sure. The news comes in the wake of concerning event that folded just yesterday. Hmm? Uh, it was captured that on November 14, 2023, the video depicted a grim scene where Ola Dibs collapsed and his friends screaming in panic, trying to revive him, yes. Prior to this shocking episode, Ola Dips had reached out to his Instagram stories, like I said the other time. Well, initially, some people dismissed Ola Dips as a mere attention-seeking move, but with the tragic news of his death, the narrative has shifted dramatically, particularly among his lawyer fan base. The happening of reactions has been profound and varied. One commenter condemned those who initially accused Ola Dips of fabricating his distress, stating that they should be ashamed, yet... Yeah. This sentiment was echoed by others who highlighted the critical issues of celebrities of whom being afraid to seek help due to public skepticism. That's doubt. The responses range from anger to deep sorrow. One user, Call Mimi, reflected on the troubling trend of young Nigerian talent passing away too soon, praying for strength for Ladi's family during this difficult time. Another user, Fluffy Bear, clung to hope, wishing that the news was just a cruel joke, underscoring the collective outbreak. It's passing has started a conversation about the importance of taking pleas for help seriously and the need for more empathy towards public figures. I am pained. I am really, really pained. This is painful. This is painful. for lot deeps. Yeah? Um, all that is good. You know, when you are talking about Nigerians, like rappers that are extremely talented. Ah, God. It is well. But I just, I think, I think there is a need to, to monitor this sickness and this depression.